Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Clavia Moore and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys five different ways you can wrap your hair, um, especially if you want to look cute, you know, if you're having a bad hair day. And if you guys stick around to the end, I'm going to show you guys how to wrap your mini me's hair too. So for the very first look, I'm going to call this the mini top knot. So the first thing you're going to do is separate your bangs and then you're going to take the rest of your hair and put it in a ponytail. You don't necessarily need bangs for this, but I just thought it looked cute. I did wear this style on many occasions without bangs. So you're going to take the head wrap. It's going to be a small rectangular head wrap and you're going to tie it in the front. You're going to twist the two strands all the way down and then you're just going to wrap it on itself creating a little turban at the top. Don't forget to tuck those ends in. Now, before I move on to the next, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Now for look two, we're going to do a cute bow. So we're going to keep our hair the same, um, same type of um, head wrap we're going to use or headband and you're going to tie it at the front again. But this time you're going to do a double knot and then you're just going to tie a bow. When you finish tying the bow, you're going to adjust it so that it doesn't look all warped. You're going to make sure that the two ends look very symmetrical and you're just going to fluff it to your liking and that's it. Just so you guys know, all of these headbands and head wraps are available in my online store and I will leave the link in the description down below. Moving on to look three, I call this the everyday headband look and you're just going to tie the headband at the top of your head, double knot it, and you're going to take the ends and tuck it into the side of the headband. That's it. I use this style when I have a headband that's not as long to make a cute little top knot and it can't wrap around twice. So for the next look, we're going to be using the longer head wraps and I am just doing a higher ponytail like really on the top of your head because we're going to be doing the top knot so you're going to take this really huge head wrap uh, bring it around the back of your head and to the top where the knot is going to be uh, i'm just pulling out my bangs so they don't get caught in the head wrap and then i'm going to be taking the two ends and pinching it together this is the no tie method because i have more control on the tightness so you're going to pinch the two ends and then you're going to roll the head wrap on itself. The more you roll, the tighter the head wrap will become. So just roll it, I guess, as much as you want it to be tight. Then you're going to take the end and wrap it around your ponytail and you're going to keep wrapping it on itself. Make sure you're wrapping to the base of the ponytail each time you go around. And then you're just going to take the ends and tuck it in. I don't know what is going on with my facial expressions, guys, but I promise you I am not hurting myself. <laughs> this is my absolute favorite head wrap out of all of the ones that I have. Comment down below and let me know which one is your favorite at the end of the video. To prep your hair for the last look, just put your hair in a low bun or a low ponytail at the back. We are doing the back bun with this beautiful yellow and blue Ankara head wrap. You're going to tie the head wrap in the back of your head, just like that. And you're going to take one side and you're going to twist it all the way to the bottom. And then you're going to wrap it around your ponytail. And then when you finish wrapping it, you're just going to tuck the end in. And then we're going to do the same with the next side. We're going to roll it all the way to the end. And then we're going to wrap it the other way around our ponytail and tuck the ends in. Coming up, you guys will see that I push the head wrap a little bit off of my hairline because I don't like it sitting directly on my hairline causing any tension. It's already fragile. And there you guys have it. So Kayla came in and saw me doing the tutorial for you guys and she wanted me to wrap her head. So I just did the mini top knot on her using my turban headband and it just turned out really, really cute. So it's the same steps that you use to do the mini turban on yourself, except that hers, I did it really, really loose because, you know, she's a baby and 
um, she'd probably go berserk if there was too much tension on her head as you guys can see it's a little wobbly I just pushed it back off her hairline a little bit and that's it Thank you guys for watching my video again. I really, really appreciate you guys supporting me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and I'll see you guys next time.